Sports with Zach Martin. It's a big night in town. Cap Rock, Lubbock, Monterey battle to see who can take control of second place in District 3-5A. Warm-ups with Cap Rock, well, they're always entertaining. Here's a couple dunks to start you off right. Now starting off with Cap Rock, they're going to start just right. Chris Wilson steal the ball from Monterey, take it back. That was the first score of the game. Right after, though, Monterey's DeQuadric Butler. He's going to end up scoring right here off the loose ball. Look at that. Seems a little bit of luck in that one. Now, Caprock going to show off some nice passing. Chris Wilson, another layup there. Good little Euro step from him. Caprock again. This time, it's my favorite name in the area, Danielle Daniel shooting the tray bomb. Monterey not wanting to fall too far behind. Capitalized on the air ball from Daniel. Has Butler. He's going to take it all the way back for the score. Monterey is talented. So is Caprock. A lot of fun to see this game. Finally, we see Butler again chasing the ball this time. Stealing it and give Monterey the lead at the end of the first quarter, and they end up going on to win this one. Tight battle 53 51. To the girls game. Start of the third quarter here, as you can see. It's going to be Monterey's Mia Trevino passes to Maddie Stevens, who gets the basket plus the foul. Right after Caprock, they're going to try to score, but you're going to see the ball is stolen by Trevino, who takes it all. The way back, and then she's going to be like, Nah, I don't need to pass. I'm taking it into the lane and scoring. Now, Caprock not wanting to get left behind. Quick pass, Sydney Johnson to Sydney McCall, who takes up and scores. And again, we see some good passing, ending with Sydney McCall taking the ball for a short little trip to the basket, though. Monterey, they get the big win 60 to 40. We go to Odessa and find the Lady Rebels of Tascosa in action. Early in the second half, Broncho's down 17. Skyler Herrera knocks down the J. And Lady Rebels in front 35-20. A minute later, we're going to slow this one down a little bit. No look pass from Alexis Merguia. Cindy Valdez knocks down the jumper from the middle of the zone. Nice assist. Tascosa back up 20. Later in the quarter, good ball movement from the Lady Rebels. Valdez finishes it off with an and one Tascosa. They go on to win this one 64 to 41. The boys, well, they were up next. Tascosa, they came out swinging in this game. Peyton Dickerson, he was the high scorer for the Rebels, finishes the layup on the fast break. Early lead for Tascosa. Later in the first quarter, it's going to be Dickinson again, dumping it off to Labirius Moore. The big fella goes off the glass right here for the score. The Rebels, they would continue to apply pressure. Bronchos, they beat the press this time, and they would get the easy basket. Tascosa would be the one who cruised to a win, though. They win this one 80 to 49.